I'm Brendan Burns. I'm an engineer on the Kubernetes team. And we're here in Google Seattle because, well, the truth of the matter is that Kubernetes and Container Engine are powered by two things. One is a desire to make the Google Cloud Platform the best place in the world to run containers. And the other is caffeine, lots and lots of caffeine. So in order to illustrate this today, we're going to have a little drag race. I'm going to turn up a Kubernetes cluster on Container Engine that's going to give us 160 cores of container-enabled compute. And at the same time, I'm going to make myself a latte. And we'll see who wins. All right, let's get down to it. I'm going to go over here to the Cloud Console. I'm going to choose to create a cluster. Let's call it my coffee cluster. Uh, we'll do it in US Central. Let's go a little big, and we'll have N1 standard 16 machines, cluster size 10. That's 160 cores. And we'll say start. All right, now I'm stepping over to my latte machine. I'm going to get some coffee going here. We're, we're brewing slate coffee today. That's a local Seattle favorite. Pretty happy with that. Grind this one out. And that looks like that's about enough. Smooth it out. Get my tamper. Always careful about this. I'm never sure I'm putting in the right pressure. We'll find out. All right. Get that on over there. And right now, Kubernetes is in the process of turning up the VMs to go along with that. It's installing the Kubernetes software on top of that. Um, and my shot is ready. I'm going to clear out the quarter filter and not spill my espresso. All right, we'll wash that out in a second. Have my limited edition Kubernetes mug. I made that myself. Pretty proud of that. All right, here we go. let's get the milk going on. Ugh. For the longest time, I actually didn't know that you could turn this on and I'd hold it here. I'd steam burns all over myself. It was terrible, but you know, live and learn, that's what I say. All right, so the Kubernetes cluster is busily, it's got the VMs already created. It's busily installing the software on top of that. My milk is foaming along just perfectly, and we're looking pretty good. All right, let's take that off there. And I'm going to pour the milk in. That's a pretty good foam right there. Of course, we're not actually done with the, with the latte right now. I have to clean up. Don't want to let the next person wash out our filter. Yikes! Yikes. That was. Wash out the porta filter. And clean off the steam wand. All righty there. And put away the milk, of course. Last step in the latte making process is enjoying the latte. And there you have it. Kubernetes cluster up, latte made, 160 cores of containerized compute, and a delicious latte with delicious, delicious caffeine.